Hey guys, it's Michaela with It's a Bond's Life, and today we are going to be making Valentine's Day Surprise. So, what you are going to need are some candy bars, whatever kind you would like. I have red velvet miniatures, um, the Kit Kat ones. I have some white cheesecake M&Ms. You're going to need a whole bag of marshmallows, four tablespoons of butter, and some popcorn. What's good about this recipe is it can be customized to any holiday that you would like. Today we're doing Valentine's Day because as you guys are watching this, it is Valentine's Day. Me and my husband would like to say happy Valentine's to you guys, you and your significant other if you have one. So you're going to need a 9 by 13 inch pan and some parchment paper. What you're going to do is spray your parchment paper with some non-stick cooking spray. Next thing you're going to do is pop your popcorn. Um, I have the bag kind of popcorn, but if you want to air pop your popcorn, you can do that as well. As our popcorn is popping, we are going to cut up our candy bars. I am using the Red Velvet Kit Kat. I'm using about 10 of them, but you can use whatever kind of candy bar you would like. After your popcorn is popped, you're going to try to get all the kernels out and leave just the popcorn in the pan lined with parchment paper. In a pot over medium heat, you're going to melt your four tablespoons of butter. Once our butter is good and melted, we're going to add our whole 10 ounce bag of marshmallows to it. So another trick I've learned is to spray your spoon with non-stick spray as well so that the marshmallow doesn't stick to it. So we are just going to stir this all together until the marshmallow melts. So as you can see, the marshmallow is almost all melted. You can go ahead and add the candy now and then pour the marshmallow over, but, but I like to add it last so that you can see the pretty colors in the M&Ms and it looks all Valentine's Day and festive. You are just going to spread it on top in an even layer over your popcorn. This is a delicious treat that is sweet and salty. My favorite combination. Alright, so while the marshmallow is still hot, you're going to want to add your Valentine's Day candy. Look how pretty this is. It just sinks in there. It's going to melt and get all gooey together. And it's going to taste delicious. You can package these in individual treats for your kid's class. Or you can eat this as a snack. Or if you're having a holiday party, this would be perfect for the kids going to let this cool for about 15 minutes and then I'm going to cut these into squares and eat them as a treat. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you and your significant other have a wonderful Valentine's Day.